Yes, hello champions, Elias Moz here. I'd like to share with you this week um, uh, tips that you can use to grow your business. I'm the author of this wonderful book, The Master Kit to Network Marketing Success. This is our French version. There's also the English version. Uh, if you're in Uganda, you can be able to get it from my office. You can get it from my restock. Uh, you can be able to get it um, all over Africa and different countries. But most importantly, you can also be able to get it online and uh, you can be able to read it conveniently on your phone, on your laptop. Those of us who are new to this channel, I've not forgotten you, are most welcome. Please click subscribe and be part of our growing family. I'm really delighted to share with you tips that I use to grow my own business. This week, we are going to discuss a very interesting topic, and that is what it means to win in business. What it means to win in business? I'm so sure that all of us, whatever business you are in, you really want to win. You really want to blossom. You really want to thrive. You really want to push yourself from one position to another. I have three definitions of uh, winning in business. The first one is winning is doing your very best. Winning is doing your very best. This is what I'm saying. I'm saying that if at the end of the day, uh, you feel that you showed up and you gave it your very best shot, that means that that day you won, as long as you gave it your very best. In fact, in this book here, I write, um, I, 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 I think I, um, in one of the chapters, I wrote about uh, the time when I was prospecting. I met this lady, a Kenyan, her name was Demian, and um, she had tried to reach her out for a whole year, and she wasn't responding, and I kept on pushing and pushing and pushing. She wasn't responding, uh, but one day she gave me a chance, and I presented. And I remember I did my best. I talked um, my heart out. I presented the products. I presented the business. I showed the vision. I did whatever I can, and then at the end of my presentation, presentation, she said, no, I am not interested. Now, having uh, been frustrated for a whole year, looking for this person, expressing myself out, pushing, you know, doing the best presentation, she said no to me. But I remember I walked out of that restaurant satisfied because I knew inside my heart I'd done my very best. And whether she had joined or not, whether she had bought uh, from me or not, whether she had joined my team or not, what was most important, I left that restaurant with my head up because I had done my very best. So my dear friends, find satisfaction in a job or that. By the way, in a, in a very interesting twist of events, eventually that person joined the business and went on to become one of the greatest team builders within my organization in Kenya. So what I'm trying to say is that as long as you give it your best, as long as you know you've done your best, you have talked the best, you have prospected the best, you have served your clients the best, that one is a win. Find satisfaction in a job or that. As long as you've done your best, you have won in business. Uh, point number two, my dear friends, it's what it means to win in business is winning is mutual thriving. Winning is mutual thriving. What do I mean? Now, every organization uh, probably has about three uh, parts of the organization or three uh, should I say persons or three people it's supposed to serve. Number one, the first team person that's supposed to serve is the business owner. That's person number one. Person number two, or people number two, if I may, is that uh, it, is, it stands to serve its employees who we can call a team, especially those of us who are into network marketing or who are in businesses that require team building. So uh, person number two is the team. Then person number three is the customers that the business stands to serve. So a business owner stands for the business owner. It stands for the team behind uh, uh, the service. Then point number three, it, it stands uh, 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 for the customers. It stands to serve. So winning in a business is only winning if all the three uh, uh, persons, if I may, have won, uh, have won. So I want us to be able to think about that for you to win in business, number one, it's not just about profit for you as the business owner. Ask yourself, what about the team behind me? Have they won? Are they happy? Are they excited? Are we working together? Then number three, the customers, are they happy? Have we served them? Have we given them the best customer service? Is uh, Have the profit, have we made it genuinely? Have we, um, if I've made the profit, have I 
also made me the team happy all um, in terms of uh, us who are into network marketing if you are number one how many people within your team are also number one if you have achieved the patrol rank how many people because of you have been able to extend above and be able to have the rank so basically winning is when you all are able to what win the customers or your clients the team or the employees but most importantly you the business one owner so those three uh, factors must be able to win so winning is about mutual thriving then point number three about winning is that winning means being number one of course winning means being number what number one but what does it mean now what it means that that um, unlike in sports when i say winning winning is almost very obvious in sports but in business uh um when i say number one then you must define what being number one really means what does being number one mean so for you to become number one first of all define what does it mean to become number one are we together what is the goal what's your vision i remember when i started the business uh, uh, of network marketing particularly with the last motion global in 2015 i remained grassing what well, grassing means that i remained an underdog for about six months. I remember for the first six months, I made less than $100. I was really struggling in all ways you can meet. The, the landlord was demanding me, rent was demanding me, I was behind with the bills, and yet I had a business. Then one day, I think um, I saw uh, my appliance bank statement, and oh my goodness, I was reading a lot of money. Same business, same everything, same products. I told myself from today, I must really work this business. And it began by me creating a vision. I told myself, even if I was only one person in the team, I told myself, I'm going to have the biggest team in the whole of Africa. It didn't matter who was above me, who had come before me, which countries were opened before Uganda, which countries were bigger than Uganda, which countries had a bigger economy than Uganda. I was very clear that I wanted to have the biggest team in Africa, and I named it the team. I named the team the Visionaries Team. And I started working and working and working only for one thing, to become the biggest team in Africa. Yes, there were ranks in the business as not working for us, as one to become the biggest team, having the biggest team in Africa. Yes, we were earning a lot of money, as not earning for money. I knew that the moment I am number one, having the biggest team in Africa, the money is obvious, the ranks are obvious, the cars are obvious, the mansions are obvious, and all the fame is very obvious. And my dear friends, I pushed and pushed and pushed only on one strong vision. We have the biggest team in Africa. And lo and behold, it was able to become possible and the reason why it was able to become possible is because i defined for me what it means to become number one now many of us are not clear about becoming number one today you want to become the biggest landlord tomorrow you want to have the biggest fashion business tomorrow you want today you want to uh, uh, maybe uh, become a star on tiktok the other day you want to become a star on instagram so basically you find that you have not defined what number one really means so my dear friends with those three definitions i really hope that you can and win big. Those of us who are this, new to this channel, please remember to subscribe and get yourself a copy of the Master Key. You can get it in any bookstore in Uganda, but also, most importantly, you can be able to get it online and in many countries all over Africa. This book is available. Otherwise, I'm really, really delighted to uh, speak to you. May God bless you. I wish you more winning in the business. Thank you so much.